My name is Johnny Scovel and this is Chase the Heat. Super excited about this one. Huh? Say that again? Exactly. All right, guys, so listen, uh, I'm here at Blazing Food headquarters and I got a hot one. This was grown by a friend of mine named Jason. Jason, thank you, bro. Look at this monster. You guys know what this is. This is a chocolate primatale. Now, um, I started the channel to grow the chili community and really a quest to find the hottest pepper. It's what I've been doing for six years. Tomorrow marks the sixth anniversary of Chase the Heat. So I want you guys to join me at 7 p.m. Uh, Eastern Standard Time. Get your questions ready. We'll do a birthday celebration. We'll do like an hour, maybe an hour and a half of question and answer. Um, it's going to be cool. Uh, six years. But anyway, uh, in searching for the hottest pepper, I found it. I just have. It's the Prima Tali. It's a seven pot Primo crossed with a Fatale. Now, this is the chocolate version. The reason this could be the hottest one ever because the chocolate and the red kind of toggle back and forth. Sometimes the red seem to be hotter than the chocolate. Sometimes the chocolate seem to be hotter than the red. So <clears throat> this has potential to be the hottest pepper that I've ever eaten. I hope it is. Um, it's sort you know, I think it used to bother people more when I'd say that, you know, six years ago. But now pretty much everybody knows that the Reaper is not the hottest pepper, so it's not, it doesn't really ruffle feathers anymore. But this one has scary potential. Let me show you the interior of this. I'm going to take a picture of it for Instagram. Look at that. Large placenta, super oily, and smells ferocious. Bless you. Bless you. You're welcome. <laughs> she has no idea that's on video. That's hilarious. All right, Jason, so I appreciate that. Uh, you sending these peppers. I have a few others they sent me that are great looking, but this is the chocolate primatale. I'm Johnny Scoville, and this is Chase the Heat. It has a smokiness to it almost. That's only happened to me a few times, right? Even if something's so hot, it makes me sneeze. Like, if you've watched the channel for a while, it's probably happened three times, four times. Wow. Wicked hot. What you hear in the background is uh, one of our Dr. Seuss machines putting stuff together for packaging. Anyway, very, very hot. It had a smokiness to it, earthy. This is a screamer, and it's still climbing. I'm burning my throat big time. My lips are burning. But wow, I'm telling you. This could be the hottest one of the year. My tolerance is pretty high right now, and this is, I'm at like a four. And I'm definitely getting that radiating heat. It's going to the back of my throat and the upper side of the roof of my mouth in the back. It's doing this. This is the hottest pepper of the year so far. I still have some more time left, so it could be something else. But this is the hottest pepper I think I've eaten all year long. You know, if you look through the, if you search the history of videos, you're going to see 10 videos to say it's the hottest pepper of the year. But I've only had six years. So what happens is if I eat a pepper mid-season, it's the hottest pepper of the year so far. That's what I say. I might, inevitably what happens is I eat another one at the end of the season that's hotter. But that's how there are multiple videos that say the hottest pepper. However, this is the hottest one of the year so far. Oh, evil, wicked bird. This is a, a you know, 
This is a 10 for anybody. This is probably a five right now on my heat scale. Wow, it's a hot one. Meet it, that's a scorcher. All right, uh, I think it's probably peaked. It has, it's peaked. I just felt a little bit of a break, but I'm telling you what, that's a monster. Just a monster pepper. My throat is just sizzling. That's a screaming hot pepper. I mean, I'm not just saying it. Honest to God, that's the hottest pepper I've had so far this year. Really, the hottest pepper I've had because that's probably the hottest pepper I've ever eaten. <coughs> Boy, I'm so excited about that. That's the coolest thing in the world because this is what I'm looking for. Wow, Jason, you're a rock star. That's a monster pepper. Be proud of yourself. I'm gonna wrap it up now, you guys. Uh, tomorrow, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, please join me. Uh, if you've got questions, jot them down. If you aren't gonna be able to be there, email, uh, put in the comment section what your question is gonna be and I'll try to uh, make sure I get to most of them. But uh, tomorrow at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, we're gonna celebrate the sixth birthday of this bus. Uh, wow. I feel like it's climbing again. I thought it was on its way down. Just a monster pepper. It's climbing again. For one pepper, my ears are burning. Hang on a minute, we should keep this going. My ears are burning, Mr. Foy, from one pepper. Good thing Josh didn't have that. I was gonna have Josh eat one of these, it would've been a bad idea. I'm burning right here in my right ear. From one pepper. Wow, that's crazy. I'm getting an endorphin rush from one pepper. Oh, yeah. Now the pain is like almost gone. Now my pain's at a one right now because I've got an endorphin rush. What pepper? That's crazy. I'm glad I didn't stop. I, I didn't stop the video when I was going to. Wow! What a great pepper! What a great pepper! It's a monster, Jason. Well done. Uh, in the description box, you're gonna see the normal stuff. Check them out. Right here is the pepper. Uh, click the pepper when you do your ride with me. Uh, if you don't want to miss any videos like this, click the bell for notification, but uh, select all, but visit us daily because they forget to send out notifications a lot. Right here, League of uh, the, the Lifeboat. Please check out the Lifeboat. If you, you or anybody you know has got an addiction of any type, you need to be on the boat. Right here, more videos. Wow. I'm Johnny Scoville. This was Chase the Heat.